It's been very, very frustrating, like, um, especially, uh, it's not not so much the last couple of weeks because we've been getting wins, but uh, mostly uh, when we haven't been performing as well as we could have, um, that it was very frustrating sitting on the sideline because I kind of felt responsible for letting the side down, or a bit responsible. Um, uh, but, you know, it's been been a good good feeling in the club at the moment. Um, you know, with that winning desire we've got and that bit of a roll on we've got at the moment, it's it's good to see. And the boys are up for training every week, every day, every week. So it's really good to see. Because the team have been doing well, did you feel that you might not get straight back in? Yeah, I did. I did think that. Um, pretty surprised actually that. Uh, I am back in, and uh, that's why I'm probably a bit nervous uh, more than usual this week because the boys have been performing good without me. So um, you know, it's, it's a bit of pressure, but it's good that I've got nerves. Um, yeah, I'm just it's not complacent, so it's a good thing I think. Now, Alan said that you've been working with him on tackling technique and that sort of thing. How's that gone? Um, yeah, it's been interesting actually. Um, uh, the first first couple of times I've picked up on a lot of things, and every training session I'd do um, ten hits of the bag at a hundred percent. And um, I think you know, just getting little tips off him, he's really helped me. And Danny, and you know, other boys like Milo and that, they've they've been putting there, um, seeing what uh, I could do better and. You know, getting the young guys to run at me as hard as they can, that whoever's not playing, and you know, it's been been a good thing, and I'm very grateful for all the boys around me. They've they've helped me with it, and it's something I have to have to fix up in my game. Um, it's just little things and stupid things like that that can let a side down. Do you feel that you're going to have to be sort of cleaner than clean now? Because obviously you did, you've had <coughs> three suspensions, so maybe people are watching you a little bit more. Referees and, and disciplinary people. Uh, I've got it in the back of my head. I didn't think I was a dirty player at all. I, you know, I'm, and I'm not going to change the way that I play. It's just you know little things like uh, tackling techniques and stuff like that that I have to fix up. And um, you know, getting frustrated. And it's been a you know, roller coaster this this year with um, you know suspensions, but um, you know I've just got to put my head down and concentrate on my game. Yeah. Did you ever get in trouble in similar lines in the NRL? When I first started, I did, um, and then obviously I I was in and out of first grade all the time, so I was always injury prone, and so I was kind of didn't feel me grooving in the NRL the last couple of years but when I first started I did and it's kind of crept back into my game now as I got more confident and uh, you know just it's just yeah it's kind of creeped back into my game and I've just got to wipe it out completely. How are you enjoying it with Daryl? Yeah, because I know Basil was a big part of you coming over wasn't he? Yeah he was um, he, and I was you know he's still a good friend of mine Basil and um, always will be but you know, I don't think I've I've hit it off as good as I have with any any other coach other than Daryl. Like we've just hit it off straight away, and um, he's kind of taken. Well, I think he's kind of taken to me, and I've taken to him. He knows like we've kind of worked each other out at the moment, um, and you know it's been really good. And he's brought a real good culture to the club, um, and that that's what it's all about. The club in general and the team, and he's a he's a good team man. And, uh, <clears throat> he's got, you know, he's got the boys' best interests at heart, which is, um, you know, you can't ask for much more than a coach. And he's, you know, he's fair, but he's firm. Must be a bit of a relief, relief to you that night. A bit worried when that's all right. Yeah, I was. Um, I didn't. I haven't had, um, you know, the best record with um, change in. Uh, in the past, but um, it's been a huge relief, and I'm still at home here. And you know, he's, you know, it's just good that you can just go up and talk to him one on one, and um, 
have a chat and not everything's about footy and I think that's that's a big plus for this club because you know you got to have your life away from footy too and as long as you're happy footy's just going to roll off it.